First thing you want to do is get a big pan and turn your stove on medium heat. This calls for two 10 ounce cans of chunk chicken meat. I used the white, uh, all white meat kind and I took a fork and I just broke it up. I'm going to take this and put it into your frying pan. And if there's some pieces that didn't get cut up, you can go ahead and do that when you stick the chicken into your frying pan. The next thing you're going to add is three-fourths of a cup of pepper okay, sauce. Okay, word of advice when you buy the hot pepper sauce at the grocery store, check the lid of the, the bottle. You don't want to get one of the bottles where it's only like drip by drip by drip because that'll take forever to measure out. So you're going to stir in this pepper sauce in with the chicken. Just give it a nice stir and you want to cook this until the chicken is completely heated. Okay, once your chicken is completely heated through, you're going to take two 8 ounce containers of cream cheese softened and put them in with the mixture. Mix it up. So now that this is all mixed together, just turn the heat down a little bit. You're going to measure out a cup and a half of cheddar cheese. And you want to take half of this and sprinkle it into your mixture. And blend. All right, now that this is all mixed in together and it's nice and warm, we're going to take this and we're going to put it into our slow cooker. Put the whole mixture in. Man, stuck. All right, so just stick that in there and take the rest of your cheese and sprinkle this on top. And then you just want to put your slow cooker on low heat and you're going to cook it until it's nice and warm and bubbly. All right, so this has been in the slow cooker on low. And I'm just going to scoop this into the middle here. And you get the idea. Doesn't that look good?